Good morning, comment room friends. It's Miss Heidi here. So today I'm going to make an outdoor mobile. This goes with the ITE we sent home, outdoor mobiles. You, the materials you may use, uh, I think, I believe the ITE says uh, an embroidery loom or a hanger. Since most of my friends out there have hangers, we're going to use a hanger. And you'll need some ribbon, some string, yarn, fishing. I've seen people use fishing lines, thread, um, and you're going to tie your items on there. You can either use just a plain ribbon, a scarf, um, to, you know, just make a plain one with different colors. This one Miss Heidi has on here, it's yellow. My picture might, it might come across as white, but it's actually a yellow. And what's this one, friends? Did you say orange? Kiss your brain if you said orange, because you know your color orange. And Miss Heidi's going to tie that ribbon on there. And I have a couple different things. You can just use ribbon. and tie them on there. You'll need a parent's help. And let's experiment. Let's look at our colors, our yellow and our orange. Look here, let, what, what happens if we blow on it like the wind? See it move? It moves. So what if we added some different size sticks on there? What do you think will happen, comment room friends, if we added, if we tied some sticks on there? Let's experiment. But let's blow on them. We'll see if it's hanging, if we're hanging it when the wind blows or if we shake it. Do you hear any noise? What happens if Miss Heidi moves it closer? So not a whole lot of noise, but Let's try to see. If we put a bell on there, what would happen? Miss Heidi's got a bell. So our outdoor mobile might become a wind chime. So what happens so if the wind is blowing or if you shake it what do you hear a bell just like a wind chime another item you can try you could tie on is seashells. So you could tie. See, Miss Heidi's got some seashells. You could tie on she sell 
seashells if you have them at home. <laughs> And you could try to experiment blowing on them or shaking them mobile and see what that sounds like. Wonder what would happen. What kind of sound would that make if we hung them? So you're gonna tie another one on here. And then talk about what you see and hear with your moms and dads commenting fun. See how the child engages in putting together their mobiles. You can use paper too. So if these were together, they make a different sound. You can use pine cones. You could use flowers and tie flowers to them. Okay, Miss Heidi's going to show you a couple of other different ways how you can make a mobile. See comment room friends? My daughter made one of these. These are origami. They're made of paper. And she used some fishing line and made a bordery loom and made frogs. What colors do you see? And fish, and she's got birds on here. I see. If you said red, kiss your brain. Blue, kiss your brain. What colors do you see? If you said purple, kiss your brain. And she has. Yellow, kiss your brain if you said yellow. All sorts of pretty pictures. Now I'm going to show you another way you can make a mobile. So as you see here, my daughter has made one using plastic flowers. See all the pretty colors? Using an embroidery leaf. She folded the bottom of the stems of the flowers and arranged them up there to make a little mobile. Her, she's got red, white, and pink. If you said those colors, if you see those colors, if you see them, it's your brain, friends. You know those colors. So once you're done making your mobiles, Miss Heidi made hers of ribbons. She has orange, pink, pink, yellow, orange. It's time to choose a place to hang it. So my comment room friends, you and your mommies and daddies and families can go and Find a place to hang it. Miss Heidi chose to hang it with a nail off her deck. So she's going to hang it up here. Oh, look. Look how it's moving in the air. See Miss Heidi's face? 
when you hang your mobiles to your face. Happy or sad? Mine's happy. I got a smile. And look here. Miss Heidi has a wind chime. Can you hear it, friends? So you could use plastic toys and beads and fishing lines to make a wind chime. Do you hear it as the wind blows? Do you hear the noises? Do you see the colors? Have fun making your outdoor mobiles. Until next time, friends, I wish you well. Bye.